Do you love country music? Then we have the opportunity for you. A pair of VIP tickets to the upcoming Delaware Junction three-day country and camping festival at the Delaware State Fairgrounds. The winner gets a three-day pass for the August 14th through 16th event to see some of country music's top artists Toby, Keith, Florida, Georgia Line, Jason Aldean, and at least 10 more. To enter, go to WBOC.com, click on our picture at the top of the page, fill out the entry, and click Submit. Now we're taking entries through Thursday, then on Friday we'll announce the lucky winner of the VIP passes to the Delaware Junction three-day country and camping festival at the Delaware State Fairgrounds. Good luck! That's going to be a great show. It is, it is. Show. Speaking Shall of we? Delaware, we got some Scrapple and a pierogi mm -hmm. here with some blue cheese. Chef, thank you again. Yeah. This is awesome. <laughs> it is cool. I'm going to use my finger here. Sorry. It oh. is awesome. It's, it's probably not as good as the dough that you made, though. Probably, probably not, not, because my dough is perfect. You have to suffer through it. Really? <laughs> that wow. is delicious. She's a lot prettier than you are. I'm sorry. <laughs> well, you yeah. are just reeling them out <laughs> today. back on the show tomorrow. Hey, we'll be there you go. Awesome. Awesome. Thank delicious. you very much. Thank, thank you. you. And delicious. we want to thank you for watching Del Marva Life. Be sure to join us tomorrow. You probably do this three times a day. Did you know it could actually reverse disease? Tomorrow, you learn a few eating habits that may help reverse illnesses. Plus, here are two food groups you might consider cutting out completely. From fighting disease to fighting fire, we're going to learn about prescribed burns and how they help keep the community safe. Essentially, it's fighting fire with fire. One woman who gave the fight of her life against breast cancer is the very successful journalist and television host Joan London. We sit down with Joan and hear all about life since the cancer diagnosis and how she's since made it her mission to educate and inspire others. The most inspiring stories are those from people overcoming challenges. Tomorrow, we're going to hear the story of one young man who's living with autism how he wrote a book to help others understand exactly what it's like. And don't forget, if you missed any of today's information, just visit WBOC.com. Click on our picture at the top of the page. Delmarva Life, life at its best here on Delmarva. We're going to work. WBOC News at 6 starts right now. How about this? <laughs> yeah.